Hey guys, so I wanted to do a mini facial. I did like a really nice facial massage um, before work this morning. Yeah, and I just, um, I got my mum to bring me down some of our like electrical facial tools. <laughs> so I thought I would film myself doing it um, and yeah, talk you guys through through it i haven't done it for a long time i got really into it during covid uh because obviously we had the time but yeah i just feel like my skin needs something so yeah so you guys can see this has really pulled off all the tan that i had on me and this is sort of what got me using it was um i thought it would be like a quick and easy fix for removing any tan that I didn't want, you know, like if you've exfoliated and it's still sort of stuck in a few sections, it's really good for like under your arms, your elbows, uh, on your fingers and on your hands and stuff. So that's another little tip that I like using this one for. Cool, so I've done that. Ugh. I just did a fresh one to go over my neck. And the one thing I would say about this product is it leaves you with a really lovely, um, Price that I come to three to four times a week. Yeah, it's okay. You don't have to. You know when it sometimes feels a bit stingy. I was like, oh my god, do I need to neutralise it with water? But yeah, I've done that. What on earth? I didn't think that tan got that dark, but just shows you. Um, and then I'm going to start off with the tripolar. So for that, you need this. This is their preparation gel. And I'm going to do it in sections because it actually ends up sinking in. Um, and it's just a bit like an ultrasound gel. And I'm going to start on this lower section of my face. And it's quite nice. It's got like a warming sensation when you put it on. It does like, um, even if I didn't <laughs> do the um, fucking hell family guys, shut up. Um, if I hadn't done the glycolic acid. Oh my God. So this is what the machine looks like. Um, and then you take the lid off and it's probably covered in gel, but it's got four things here which emit microcurrents and then it's got this tiny bit in the middle which looks like, <laughs> um, but that does the muscle activation like that. So you stick it on here. Okay, you hear a beep. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, there we go. So you hear the beep go on, and then the green is um, the microcurrents. So you would go in a circle until you feel it get hot, and it will click to tell you to move on. So that's what I'm going to do all over my face. But for this section of my face, I'm going to do the oh, yeah, sorry, microcurrent and the so, so muscle activation. So I'm going to go on to the highest setting of the two. That's with the blue. And you should be able to hear it. Let me just pause the TV. One sec. Onto the blue. And then you'll be able to, should be able to hear, hear it. Oh, sorry. That's what it sounds like. So once it gets hot enough, you can hear, and that's it doing the, the like muscle activation where it's like zapping the, the muscle. Ooh. So yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and do that under my chin and then I will come back. Right, so that is what it looks like after. And I've, I have actually only gone over it the once. Cause there are two settings. So the first one is like not as, um, as a sharp twinge. So they say you build yourself up to the, the second setting 
which I suppose is kind of the point because then you build up a tolerance and then also it works better. I feel like you you shouldn't rush it because you want it to last a lot longer. And I feel like, you know, once you, it's like everything, once you get to the like highest percentage or, you know, like something that's the strongest and you sort of grow out of it. Whereas I said, this was quite expensive. I wouldn't want to not be able to, <laughs> not be able to use it. Um, so yeah, I'm just going over a few more times. Um, and it beeps when the sections got hot enough and I do remember what sort of stopped me from using it was my mum had said um, that she'd read um, it can be bad for younger faces to do it because you end up losing some of the volume in your skin from the heat uh, like the microcurrents I think it was which might be completely wrong but so you can lose some of the volume and so you don't sort of have that youthful look, which is true. I wouldn't want to lose that, obviously. But yeah, I haven't done it for ages and I just do really, really like the results um, combined with the second part. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do this. The gel I had on, did you just hear it beep? Um, which means that section's done. The gel I had on um, is like up here basically, so once I need to move it higher, I'll, uh, I'll apply some more. So I'm on to the next section. I'm just... Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm just doing the same thing. I need to go a bit slower. Uh -huh. Right, and last section, the forehead. Um, this one's I, I always find hard because there's just not really much there to for it to sort of push into, like your face you can see, whereas um, I'm hit. <laughs> it's so awful on here. Um, yeah, it's, so, it's a bit harder to do, but it's okay. I was um, doing a video earlier and I dropped my gua sha and it smashed. And it was a gift. Um, I'm so annoyed. But I might try and glue it back together because I did do that with another one and it worked. But I was just like, oh, always happens. So yeah, I'm just going to do the same thing. But you can kind of see it's a bit harder whereas on here you get the movement. But it's fine. Cool, so that is me done, I think. I'm just going to unplug it, pop it on the side. And what I'm going to do now is um, wash this off, just with water, because I think it is water this. Um, uh, it's like glycerin. Uh, I, I'm still going to do it with water. <laughs> Then I'm going to grab the next part. Cool. So for the final part, um, I'm going to put on my boost mask. So it's all clean. I have taken the strap over from over the head. It's just in the bag. Um, before I do that, I'm going to apply my serums because they say you can apply um, something as light as a serum. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, my skin feels amazing. It literally feels so soft. I just used some water um, to wash that off and it came straight off. But anyway, it is lovely. It does usually leave my skin really nice. So um, it feels so good. My skin feels so, so nice. And then this is just going to help with my um, flare-ups from my Sam of the Month slash... 
the mask really. Then I'm gonna go in my triple hyaluronic acid serum. Just one pump. Yep, and then I'm just gonna go in with this. And I'm gonna do two two blasts on it. Oh, I've pulled it down there. I'm gonna do 20 minutes, um, which is the optimum amount of time. And then I'm going to apply my Beauty Pie sleep oil, which I'll just grab from down um, up by my bed. Yeah, and then that'll be it. And I'll show you guys what my skin looks like in the morning because it'll probably be a lot more, <sighs> everything would have worked a bit better. <laughs> so yeah, I'll see you in 20. So I've just finished my uh, 20 minutes and I put on the Beauty Pie sleep oil and bring it all the way down. Um, yeah, it's the Super Healthy Skin Amazing Sleep Oil with Padanam, whatever. Um, but yeah, I've nearly finished it. I used to not really love it when I first got it, um, but it's weird i don't know what changed oh uh, and it started working really well for my skin so yeah i really love it um that is all from me for this evening i've pressed that in um i'm gonna go to bed and then i'll come back in the morning and show you what my skin looks like but this is it for now Yeah, just a bit red from the microcurrent and then the pressure of the the mask and where it sits. But hopefully it will look nice and even and a bit tighter and fresher in the morning. So I will see you guys then. So good morning, guys. This is what my skin looks like um, this morning after it's a bit oily there. Maybe I got hot in the night, but... Yeah, you guys can see it looks, I think it looks really nice. I'm going to turn the, the lights off and scoot you over so you can see what it looks like in daylight. It's so weird, isn't it? I feel like freckles always make, look at my bags, <laughs> make everything look like your skin's not even, but then I also love them. Um, so yeah, that was, that was the results this morning, um, of my mini facial last night. So yeah, it looks a bit better. I wish I had a little mirror, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Ask me any questions about the devices. I'll put the links below so that you can read about them and stuff. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.